Hey, I'm Tony Scott, and thanks for watching. Here's some news you may have missed. Two of Nelson Mandela's daughters are suing him for the right to his art collection and control of his money. Now, court almost 10 years ago gave Mr. Mandela the right to fire his attorney and keep the attorney from selling any of Nelson Mandela's valuable art pieces. The attorney, Ishmael Ayab, is now representing his daughters, Makazawe and Zanani Mandela. Their lawsuit wants Nelson Mandela's current attorney and two other men removed as trustees and everything put in their name. Now, do they sincerely want to look out for their father? Nelson Mandela is fighting the lawsuit, and I guess that pretty much says he doesn't want his daughters getting their hands on his fortune. Why? Well, who knows? Maybe they know he's not well physically or mentally. Maybe they're just two foul daughters trying to get a head start on the money grab. Who knows? Hey, in Tasmania, a man set up a camera to record a ghost, but instead caught his 28-year-old wife and his 16-year-old son having an affair. The wife went to her stepson's room to talk about driving lessons. She really wanted riding lessons. Talking led to tickling, which led to kissing, which led to sex. Knocking the boots. Bumping uglies. Poo poo la la. Nudie crunch. Slapping skins. Bow chicka bow wow. She denied it, but eventually she did come clean. She thought the age of consent in Tasmania was 16, but it's not. It's 17. Now she's embarrassed and ashamed and is trying to patch things up with her husband, who she has a child with. She'll be sentenced next week. I guess there is such a thing as a Tasmanian devil, huh? Real Bronx Tours has stopped their ghetto tours. The tour showed people waiting in line at a pantry. It passed a park, once known for high crime, called Pickpocket Park. The tour was $45. They stopped doing it, but they're not answering their phone to explain why. My question is this. What in the entire... F you got time for one more? A man, a Chicago man, on his honeymoon with his wife in Orlando was reported missing. His wife was concerned. Police were called. And it turns out he wasn't missing. He was already locked up for trying to hire a prostitute who was actually an undercover cop. The man, Muhammad Ahmed, was arrested after responding to an online ad. They also caught him with weed. Really, dude? Your name means praiseworthy. But I'm thinking, you know, maybe not so much, really. You know what? Let's just say you're a dog and you're not going to change. But for whatever reason, you decided you were going to marry your girl. Cool. You'll get married and in time, you'll go back to your doggish ways. But you couldn't for a few days on your honeymoon? Really? Then you could go back to Chicago and pick up on your hoish ways and, you know, you couldn't do that? You couldn't stay true to your bride? <sighs> now understand, I'm plowing the road for you, man giving you a pass for being who you are. But you couldn't be true to your wife on your honeymoon. Really? Even other dogs are going, really? I leave you with the next mayor of Detroit, Michigan, Melinda Brown Duncan. Dad Bing and his man, I mean, and the governor, y'all problem is y'all just sitting up there collecting a check. If y'all really want to run the city of Detroit, Come around here in every block of the city of Detroit, look through these houses, if they ain't no good, tear that down so people can stop finding dead relatives in these damn house and pay these damn Detroit cops what they supposed to earn for being out here protecting the city of Detroit. If not, put my in office. I'll show you how to damn run the city of damn Detroit, and I don't know nothing about it, but I learned quick, fast, and hurt to get y'all sorry up out of here and do the right damn thing. That's why the hell the city of Detroit. That's why people don't want to come to the city of Detroit. Because y'all sorry getting off your and doing it with y'all damn family members. Y'all to do the right damn thing. So kiss my black and get off the office. Bye. Hey, that's all I got. Like, subscribe, but don't tell Melinda I played her video. I'm Tony Scott. Thanks for watching.